What's going on guys? Welcome to my tutorial on Adobe Premiere Pro and After Effects CS6. In this video I'm going to show you guys how to utilize Adobe's Dynamic Link. This feature will allow you to work with both programs easily. So over here in Premiere Pro I'm going to right click on my video and I'm going to select Replace with After Effects Composition. If you don't have the program opened up, After Effects will open and let's call this tutorial. Instead of the video itself on the timeline, it's turned into an After Effects project. Let me come over here to After Effects. So I'm just going to add another layer and I'm just going to create myself a mask. Now that the mask is created, I'm going to go File Save. Let me come back over here to Premiere Pro, and you notice that the video is updated. A lot of people ask me about this when I'm editing video in Premiere Pro or After Effects. What are the differences? Well, for Premiere Pro, it's more of an editing program. They have transitions, and yes, there are certain effects that you can add, but really After Effects allows you to add a lot more things when it comes down to effects. And with Dynamic Link, you can use both programs at the same time and switch back and forth. It's really helpful. And this is a great workflow between the two programs, and Adobe did an amazing job with CS6. So that's your tutorial with Dynamic Link in Adobe Premiere Pro and After Effects CS6. I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial, and I'll see you guys later. Cheers.